Hey there everybody, are those here from Ice Games bring you episode 159 of my Guild Wars 2 Ranger Let's Play with uh, Keyvina here in this little tunnel with a giant hole down here <laughs> uh, because we're about to leap into the giant pit leading to Kesho uh, because we have been looking for Kesho, kind of the lost, well we called it the lost city, we learned it's called Kesho and Vlast as a part of this and stuff like that. So we're trying to figure out what we can do to stop Balthazar. Uh, now that the other human gods are gone, we're going to where the Forgotten are. Um, as you can see, kind of a Forgotten statue by here uh, and all this Forgotten stuff here. How does no one like, like this is pretty, pretty obvious. And I'm pretty sure, you know, we got magic and stuff in this world. We could have like seen down there, but either way, <laughs> they, they, uh, I mean, even um, the, the Risen, they're just, they're just like, they're like, they're not risen, sorry, the, uh, like the mummies and stuff. Um, uh, Choco's crew could have just, like, thrown a bunch of people down there and they would have been okay to see what's down there. But either way, <laughs> we're gonna jump down there ourselves and, uh, figure out what's going on there. But yeah, uh, thank you guys so much for uh, joining me for this, uh, episode. Um, yeah, I'm really excited for this. Let's, uh, hop on in and, uh, see what's at the bottom. Uh, the way forward. Ooh. The way forward is down, I guess. The way forward is down. Yeah, last episode, just, just, just so much running around and talking to people. Hello? Ooh. Hello? Commander, are you talking to me? Your signal's really strong. How'd you do that? I jumped into a deep pit. Good job. Wherever you are must be on a ley line nexus. Listen, I found something. A lost city called Kesho. It's buried, so I could use your help finding my way around. Buried city? Really? Oh, Cron, I wish I was there. Describe what you see. Everything. In detail. There's sand drifts and debris everywhere. And pedestals like the ones in Taria, with exalted sentries floating on them. Alright. So let's scour the area here. Uh, scour, scour Kesho for information. Uh, Timey wants to see everything. Can we take photos? Is that a thing we can do in this world? I'd like to hope it's a thing we can do. Hello, uh, unknown exalted. Something about this exalted. It's moving, so it's alive, but it's not responding to my presence. Wait, not responding? Poke it with something. No, no, wait. Don't. That's poor research etiquette. Well, maybe just a light poke. Ugh, I want to be there. <laughs> just, just a little poke. There's this spear thing. Oh, there's more exalted here. The pedestal without anything. Here's something that could be a console, but it looks dead. Huh? Probably needs a power source. Look around for a crystal or anything bright and shiny. Okay. Go look for something bright and shiny. Anything bright and shiny around here? So long, I can't remember where bright and shiny is. Uh, let's put on Griffin. Ooh, and well, if we're looking for, I think I gotta go up. If I remember correctly. Um, and well, I'm getting bright and shiny. I haven't read the full details, um, but it looks like Guild Wars uh, 2 is going to be changing the way that they do expansions. Um, I'm not sure exactly how that's going to work, um, but I saw uh, a post uh, by the uh, arena net saying that, and I'm, I'm, I'm optimistic. Uh, it seems like they're going to be doing smaller expansions, not these larger ones every couple of years. I'm hoping that means we'll get like one one kind of um, uh, expansion every year. That'd be kind of awesome. It's bright and shiny here. I did the same thing last time, I believe. I couldn't find it. But yes, I'm very interested to see what they uh, plan on, on doing with that. It could end up being pretty awesome. I'm pretty sure someone's yelling at the screen, being like, do this, do this, you fool. 
Oh, and I also, I believe there's some something happening with World vs. World. Uh, by the time this should be out. Oh, Found here's something shiny. Found a crystal and a dead body. Oh, hope the crystal's not what killed the body. Only one way to find out. Pick it up. Let's read the journal. Um, no way in, no way out. Uh, we're turning, running out of food. I have to... Dis indecipherable. Okay. So apparently someone didn't realize that they could pick up whatever this is and put it on this pedestal. But yes, uh, there's some changes to World vs. World coming out soon. Kind of excited to try that. Ooh, there okay. we go. Power's on. Uh oh. That door opened. What was that noise? A door just opened. There's another exalted inside. Not red like the others. It looks dormant, but maybe I can wake it. Well, carry on then. You know what you're doing. Boy, hello. No! Did Balthazar send you a Joko? I will defend this sacred ground with my life! Wait, I'm a friend. We don't like Balthazar either. The commander's on a mission to stop him. Balth is the only clue we've got. What have you done? The pedestals are reviving the forged. The glowy red ones are forged? <sighs> Good thing you didn't poke them. You claim to owe Balthazar no allegiance. Prove yourself. Destroy his creations. Okay, so let's go dis defeat the exiled. Or the forge exiled. Uh, uh, the forge exalted. Why can't the way I read that word is exiled? I'm silly. Protect me. Yeah, I think there's like a um, something you can do if you if you uh, defeat them before they wake up, which I, clearly I'm not going to be able to do on my own. But that's something we can do as a, a group. That's, that is something I definitely want to want to do sometime. Is just go through and do all of uh, the mastery points and stuff, or the um, the special objectives and stuff, the achievements. Both is the reason I'm here. He's working to kill Krakatoric, and we're trying to stop him. I wish you'd come sooner. Balthazar was here recently with that wretched lich, Joko. Praise Joko. Apparently, I'm the chosen champion and protector of Glint's second scion, Orin. If you've been entrusted with the role of the scion's protector, then it would be my honor to assist you. I am Sadazi. Welcome to Kesho. Okay. What you see is what's left of the Forgotten's first attempt to pacify the Elder Dragons. It failed. This site was abandoned, but a few of us remained as its caretakers. Why were Balthazar and Joko here? They came seeking the forgotten magics that imbue battle armor with living spirits, the same that created the Exalted. They quickly discovered they could use those magics to create these abominations, the horrors they call forged. The Red Exalted you fought were the results of their early experiments on us. Left behind as mindless centuries. In the chaos, I sealed myself in that chamber to avoid the fate of the others. That was smart. Now you can help us make sure Balthazar doesn't succeed. Balthazar thought he destroyed the information you seek. But the centuries he left behind were actually protecting it. What do you mean? The pedestals! Your invisible friend is correct. <laughs> I can reveal the secrets contained in any pedestal you choose. All right, let's go to uh, this pedestal, because it's the closest one. Come here, friend! I like how the name actually changes, too, when we learn their name. It's pretty awesome. Lint was the key. She, she was perfect for our purposes. A scion of an elder dragon, and a crystal dragon herself, with a mind of her own. We, we did our work well. The Glint actively rejected Krakatoric, and she brought forth more scions to join our cause. That was Jasso Escher, one of the Legacy's main architects. 
Sadly, he was lost in the attempt to convert Kralkatorik. Wait. Convert Kralkatorik? Yes. The Forgotten dared to try. But the hunger of Elder Dragons is too strong. It proved a tragic failure. More of your questions can be answered by consulting the other pedestals. Okay, so let's check the other ones. Hurry up. The most important lesson an exalted must learn is although elder dragons are unimaginably powerful, they, they can be killed. Each has a distinct flaw. Mordramoth, for example, dominates thought, but, it, but its most powerful asset, its mind, is also its greatest liability. Kralkatorik's unique strength, its power to crystallize objects, is also its singular weakness. It, it, its creation share a fundamental resonance that connects them back to the crystal dragon and makes them vulnerable to each other. A fundamental resonance that makes them vulnerable. Whoa, so that's why Balthazar was after Vlast. He needed a scion of Glyph to kill Falkatoric. But Vlast's gone now, so that means... Wait, there's one thing I don't understand. If Glint and the Forgotten knew what killing an Elder Dragon would do to Tyria, why would they rear Vlast and Orin? The answer is locked behind that door. If you're done with the pedestals, we can proceed. All right. Well, there's only one last. Although there's a couple more pedestals here. Um, let's just head down the door uh, to proceed. Well, I'll bring you here. Actually, let's just go. Come, let's go. Actually, you know what? Maybe we should. Oh, never mind. <gasps> Protect me. Oh, I think I might have been too far away. Come on, Rocky, get him. Protected. We got the trainer here. What? Search and rescue. I do like. I do really like the look of the forged. Uh, Rocky, what are you doing, buddy? We good? Oh, we good. We're doing your attacks. Gosh, they look so awesome. Protect me. Put up a shield here. Then behind you. This, this is a bunch of damage to me. I don't remember all the abilities of uh, of my character. Protect me. Come on. We heal as one. Down. Come on. There we go. Chaos. The door isn't responding. It must have been damaged during Joko and Balthazar's attack. You're in luck because the commander is good at smashing things. Yep. Break down the door. Ooh. What's this? Um, order 134. Disable gate leading to the final pedestal. Destroy any living creatures that attempt to cross. Okay. Oh. We're just supposed to attack it. Okay, this must be the final pedestal thing. <laughs> He's in there healing my pet. Awesome. Dragon cycle is one of feast and famine. Ravenous, they rise, 
Sated, they sleep. Glint and the Forgotten set out to break this cycle of extremes and to restore true balance. But when two Elder Dragons were unexpectedly eliminated from the cycle at one time, we believe they created a void. A void that caused the system to break down and the collapse to begin. was that Glint's legacy would stabilize the cycle. We theorize these vacancies must be filled with entities that circulate and share magic rather than hoard it. Only then will the balance of magic truly become stable. Only then will Glint's legacy achieve its ultimate purpose. Oops. <laughs> well, we've killed two elder, two dragons so far. The scions of Glint are more important than we thought. Balthazar only sees them as a means to gaining power, but they could be instrumental in restoring the natural balance. If you are, in fact, the true protector of Glint's legacy, then it's up to you to stop Balthazar from taking her. But know that he will let nothing deter him from his goal of killing the Crystal Dragon. Timey, get a message to Ritlock, Kanok, and Kazmir. There's a spire south of the Skimmer Camp, tall enough for Kiel's airship to moor. Tell them to meet me there. Commander, you must leave, now. I can feel the forged approaching. If you are able to find Kesho, then I fail to adequately conceal the entrance. I must close the entrance forever. This portal will allow you to return safely to the surface. But what about you? I will keep my pledge to protect this sacred place with my life. I am at peace. Farewell, Commander. Okay. Well, we finish this one. Um, forgotten Holdings. Let's club a click to open it. See what we get from that. Boom, boom, boom. We get... Ooh. Rise the banners, uh, so uh, sun sphere support. Collect five items. That must be uh, this item here, and then some stuff we can. Oh, we can deposit that actually. So let's do that and let's um. Here's the. Oh, what's this we can do up here? Climb the spire at the cave. Wait, is there something else we can do here? Oh no, so it's just a portal we can use. Okay. Boop. 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 I love portals. Oh, hello. Just randomly magically show up through a portal and you're just like, oh, cool. Hey, how's it going? All right. Um, Let's see. Climb the spire. Where are we headed to? We're headed this way. Okay. So we know what that means. That means Griffin Mount. The best mount. Although I do got to get the sky scale mount eventually. Oh yeah, I'm trying to climb this. Okay. I think I'm going to be able to make it here. Come on. Oh gosh. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Fine, we'll do it the old fashioned way then. We heal as one. Oh, you're a veteran one too, okay. My pet's doing okay. I'm doing okay. healing down here. Someone else was attacking me over here. Okay, yeah. The Forged War Mage here. Deal with you. Whoa. Protect me. 
All the fury. Protected. I forgot of you, Officer. What? Let's actually climb it properly this time. There we go. Okay, would I like to continue your story the departing? Yes, I would. Let's enter the instance. Are they riding puppies, it looks like? Looks like they're riding puppies. Okay, let's meet our companions. So thankfully you're right up here. <gasps> nope, that's a Balthazar. Expecting someone else? What's this? Have your friends abandoned? Protected. Protect me. What do you say we take things a little more slowly this time? Oh, yeah, Balthazar, are we? We heal as one. We are literally. F I mean, we killed two elder dragons, but we are fighting a god. Well, is Balthazar still technically a god if he's been banished by the other ones? We I'm gonna say no, one. which is a very, very powerful uh, entity. Owie. Never defy a god. Shh. You're no god of mine. Oh, Silvari. Definitely not a god of ours. Okay, let's keep moving. See, out of all these every effect attacks that look kind of awesome, actually, when they smash into the ground there. Okay. Search and rescue. I chose you. Fury rising. Ooh, ooh, that hurt. We heal at one. Protect me. Sixty-seven percent. Good. Come here. Go back to Rocky. We heal at one. Oh, 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 oh. <gasps> oh no. Suffer a little more loudly. Cry out. Let everyone hear. Oh, ouch. Ouch, 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 ouch. We heal at one. Down to sixty percent. Come on, Rocky, we got this. I actually totally forgot about this fight. Oh no. Search and rescue. Oh, come on. I chose you. Protect me. At least I, I feel like I'm dodging all right here. I feel like I'm doing okay with that, that part at least. Oh, and then I got hit, of course. We heal at one. I chose you. Some heal on. There we go. Dodge that. Excellent. We're not finished yet. I do enjoy these little get togethers. Oh, there's so much, so much fun about these guys. So, so, so much fun. We heal, search and rescue. Can't wait to finish you off for good. I keep forgetting that one's got a more of a ranged attack to it. Got 
down to 30%. That's doing Protect good. Me. Come on. Get behind them so then he can't use that ability on me. How about that? I think that works. 24%. I don't know why I'm counting down the percentage, but hey, just in case someone's uh, not able to see the tiny numbers there. I do love how you can have percentages. Oh, nope, that um, did not work. You're proving to be quite useful. Oh, you're welcome. I'm glad, I'm glad you're enjoying our time here, Balthazar. Some, someone's got it, right? The <laughs> reading keeps getting smaller and smaller. We heal as one. Oh, oh, that fire's staying a little bit longer Listen, too. Ten percent. Thought we kind of did though. <laughs> ah, the sire. Come here to defend your champion. No. <gasps> no, Uri, no. such a cool moment i love that so much where they actually did kind of like attack you like that with the tendrils coming around your eyes the blackness overtaking us Determine who or where and who you are. Oh, Rocky, you died too. Oh, it's, it's very blurry tier too, so we can't actually see what's going on here. Joko. Praise Joko. Joko? I'm sorry. I, I don't know that name. Liar! All who take breath know me. I am King Joko the Inevitable. The last primeval king. Joko the Undying. The Scourge of Vabi. Joko the Feared. Joko the Beloved. Joko, the eternal monarch of all. How dare you claim to not know who I am? But you're not a spirit. What are you doing here? I was deceived by the fallen god Balthazar. I led him here to claim spirits for his army. In exchange, I was promised a share of his new recruits. But he betrayed me and stranded me here instead. Perfidy, from now on, the only god I trust is me. 
You are no god. You are an abomination inflicted on the crystal desert like a wound, like a plague. I am a god. God king of Elona, the crystal desert, and all their environs. Genuflect, peasant. You have no authority here. Only the judge does. He was appointed by Grim, a true god. Ah, gods, dragons, nations. Soon all will grovel at the feet of Paloa Joto. Come, gentle spirit. You must take the next steps. And I've heard enough of Joko's blasphemies. Let's follow her to the judge. See, and again, like, this is... The domain oh. of the lost is dangerous. Stay close to me. Like, I'm still so, so confused about the, the human gods. He is a loyal servant of Grin, charged with sending all the spirits who come through here to their appointed place. I don't know who I am. I don't know where I should be. Come, spirit. Do not be afraid. Present ourselves, but like, Grenth is gone now. So, but like, I'm still still confused. Like, the human gods, like, were they actual like gods, or were they just like hugely power like powerful entities, or because I mean, clearly, like, Grenth created this place, created this judge, um, so created a place to kind of control the spirits. So, like, what happened to the spirits before this? Like, the human spirits, or I'm Silvari and I'm here. I'm not a human. So, does that mean like like Silvari and Char and Asura, all their spirits come here too? So, Grenth was kind of just the god of death, not just a human god, but the god of all of death. Uh, is that kind of the idea, or is that just thinking too much into it? Uh, but yeah, now that Grenth's gone. Does someone else have to? Does this judge now taking over as the god of death? Will this place eventually fade if Grenth leaving with like the human gods leaving? Will their 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 what they've done to the world will, will it fade or is it only existing here because there's uh, humans that worship them? Is it kind of like um, uh, 40k with the warp? Those warp entities exist because someone worships them, kind of a thing. I'm really curious on uh, again. This is something I really want to do some research on and, and learn about. Unless you guys uh, know a good place to go. Very curious on how this works. I mean, I know it does work. I'm just curious on how it works. I'm not even sure why I'm here. Or even who I am. That's because most spirits find their own way to their fate when they die. But those whose deaths are too traumatic often forget who they were or how they perished. These spirits, like you and me, end up here, in the domain of the lost. I can't be here. You will reach your rightful place in time. First, you must recover your name, to know who you were and how you lived. Then, you must learn your purpose, to understand the choices you made, and why you lived as you did. Once you know your name and purpose, only then can I determine your final destination. But how do I do that? Nana has traveled the path you now face. She can assist you. For though they may have belonged to you in life, once your name and purpose enter this domain, they are yours no longer, and you will have to fight to reclaim your name. Now, arm yourself. Okay, let's search for weapons. So you discovered your name. How do I reclaim mine? I learned my name from the spirit of my old mentor, but only after vesting him in a challenge of riddles. I discovered my purpose hidden in an old diary I had written as a child. I was a teacher. Is it that simple? It's different for everyone. The judge said you must fight to recover your name. So you clearly were the teacher. A soldier, perhaps? I... I don't know. Well, if you are to fight, you must first arm yourself. With what? Spirits must abandon their possessions before they may move on. 
All right, so let's um, find our weapons. Kind of pointed this way, right? No, nope, that's a that's a dead spirit. That's a lost spirit. I can talk to you. Hello, lost spirit. Please stop running. Look around the area, and perhaps you will find something useful. Okay. Anything useful around here? Anything at all? Let's see. Not seeing anything useful. Oh, there's a lost spirit. Maybe we can talk with you. Uh, it'll come for you. What will? It. it. Okay, let's just leave. Oh, here's a brap. Oh, here's another lost spirit. So, m mom, dad, is that you? Oh. Another thing I can search through. Maybe there'll be weapons in here. Nothing here. I'll have to keep searching. Is another lost spirit? It, it hurts. What? Everything. Okay, I'm so sorry. Oh. There's some more stuff here. There we go. Fight with this. That spirit looks just like me. We should follow. Come here, spirit that looks just like me. Oh, this is going to be full of spiders. It has a devastating melee attack. Oh, apparently that's me. I have devastating melee attack. Oh. But no pet. I still don't remember. Then more than one must have claimed your name, which means it must be a prestigious one. Quick, find another shadow. Okay. Uh, I yield. I yield. Take it. It's yours. Uh, why did you steal my name? I, I don't know. Whoop! Whoop! Something's attacking me. Oh, there's another one. Oh gosh! Oh gosh! Oh gosh! Oh gosh! Oh gosh! Oh gosh! Heal, 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 heal. Boom, I'm back. I'm back, baby. Let's do this. Get out of that. Why is my health bar blue right now? Is that just a spirit thing? No, still nothing. Okay, did you steal my name? If you don't reclaim your name quickly, you could lose it forever. Oh, I don't want to lose my name forever. Oh, there is another one of me. This one's got a bow. Oh, oh, I apologize for the uh, loud um, windows ding there. Something just popped up on my screen. Hopefully nothing too important. Oh. Remember now, my life was filled with conflict. Don't know I'm Victory. here or trapped. I'm alone. This will be... Oh, it'll be this way forever. Get together. Your name's out there. I can tell. You wielded that weapon like a true fighter. But I... I don't know why I fought, what I strove for, or against. Next is your purpose. What drove you forward and ultimately led to your death? The answer is here, somewhere in the domain of the lost. You just have to find it. Okay. But how will I know it? Where will I find it? If you truly desire it, your purpose will find you. Okay. Looking for my purpose now. I start with the bird. We, we will defend the tree. Be gone, monster. Oh, I remember that. The very start of our journey. Where'd the birdie go? Here's the birdie. Valiant, the pale tree summons you. Again, why am I a Savari? Why am I here? When, when Zaitan rose from slumber. The dragon found a long dead nation and claimed it. And like there's char spirits and 
um, Astura spirits. Or maybe Norn spirits too? I didn't notice. The soul of Tyria mourned as her children were cut down by the beast. The land wept and the world shuddered. Nobody believed I had courage. Not even me. And then you came along. Aww. And you trusted me then, my friend. I need, I need you to trust me now. I, I can do this. Oh, left plot paw. Oh, ho, ho. Where'd you go now, Birdie? Oh, there it is. Our victory at Fort Trinity will show the world that we can strike against the dragons. I like when games do these kind of like little recap things. We can assault Arad. We can, we can destroy Zaitan before the dragon's inflection claims us all. We have, we have succeeded, but only by coming together to fight a greater foe. You have shown the way. You've had, You've had my gratitude, Commander, for all you've done. Tonight, Tonight I, saw I saw it. I, I, I stared into the abyss, and it stared back at me. So, so much power. I don't, I don't know what's real and what isn't anymore. Oh, I notice her name changed right there. That's actually more meaning now that I've actually gone back and played season one. With a different character? It makes much more sense now. The city. It's, it's gone. gone. And lines are being destroyed. And, and here, at the center, is the lone me. Aren't you even And her marrying it? Yep, I this makes so much more sense now. All this chaos and destruction. That makes so much more sense. Listen, Listen. her shield dropped when she attacked. Make, Make it count. End this. No! We actually did that part. That was really cool. Yeah, that whole that makes so much more sense now. You, you, you fools! You, you think my death saves, saves you? Too late. This, this, this world is mine. And that's what brought us to Mordremoth. I have something I can no longer protect. You must understand its importance to Tyria's future. All right. Keep following my purpose here. You're not leaving until you tell me the truth. We come from the jungle, dragon. We belong to it. We are meant to serve it. <gasps> oh no. Where'd, where'd you go now, Birdie? There you are. With everything we had to deal with here, the hack fleet may have already launched. Oh, and that's when we crashed. In the jungle? a welcome sight, Commander. The situation is grim. Mordermoth tore the fleet apart. Pact is in ruins. <laughs> the enemy, Mordremoth. You hear its voice too, but you resist. So, so does Kanak, and so do I. Thank, thank you, Commander. Again, that happened because I was Savari and we could hear Mordrabas' voice a little bit, which was a really cool thing to do, is change it per the race you were playing. 
Oh, I forgot. Oh. Oh, air. Lens, 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 offspring has chosen you. Channel this gift to get the egg to safety. Go, go, go. Confront Mordroth. No matter how that mission ends, know that you have restored hope to Tarir and to the world. You must kill me, Commander, before that seed grows, before Mordromoth reclaims what it has lost. What have you done? Oh. Oh. Oh, stuck behind some vines. There we go. Our creator now lies vanquished. Where does that leave the Silvari? What is our place in this new world we've created? Dragon's Watch. I like that. And Tyria would probably sleep more soundly with the Dragon Slayer at the helm of a new guild. So only you get to decide when we take down a dragon? Only you are allowed to kill them? You know, you know what, Commander? I'm glad you didn't join Destiny's Edge. My mother wouldn't want you in there. And I'll lay down my life for... Uh, what should we call it? Oh. Her. Her. Her name is Aurene. Yeah, Aurene. The best. The best of their dragons. I am the last Mersat. Many years ago, you knew me as Lazarus the Dyer. I have returned from the brink of existence. But, but who would pose as Lazarus? No, it can't be. We learned that we are actually fighting Balthazar. I remember Balthazar. He wants revenge on the other gods. He's going to use all me to get it. I have to convince the judge to send me back. Okay, let's return to the judge. Whoa! Oh, thankfully I did not get hurt there. I did not realize I uh, did not have my... Um, my glide glider thingy there. Speak with the judge. My name is Judge. <laughs> uh, my name is my my name is Judge. Okay, no one was going to get that right. Comes all, noble <laughs> spirit. Step forward, and I will send you to your appointed place. Okay. You must let me go back. I see you clearly now, Commander. Balthazar killed you. But you would face him again? Balthazar has done great harm here. The magic he uses to hijack spirits shakes the foundations of the domain of the lost. But I cannot help you. If I could only get back, if I could defeat him, it might undo the damage he's done in both our worlds. <sighs> It is too late. No life remains in your body. Unless, when Balthazar left, a fearsome beast, the Eater of Souls, rose to prey on the waning life energy of the spirits here. 
That's got to be the screams I've heard in the distance. If you were to defeat the beast and claim its power, that life energy might be strong enough to reanimate your body, allowing you to go back. But if you were to fail, the beast would consume your entirety. I could grant you no final reward or punishment. Your spirit would simply cease to be. I'll take that risk. Now that I've rediscovered my purpose, I have to go back to finish what I started. Then in Grenth's name, conquer the Eater of Souls and live again. Remind Balthazar that none escape judgment. All right, so no pressure. We just have to go and kill some uh, beast thing. Um, but actually, I think I'm going to save that for um, uh, next episode because uh, we're coming up on 50 some minutes here. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this one. Next episode, we will regain our purpose. Well, okay, I guess we kind of regained our purpose, but we will take down the Eater of Souls and hopefully not be devoured uh, entirely uh, and um, uh, get back to our body, become reanimated. So technically, we'll be undead from now on. Is that kind of how that technically works? But either way, thank you guys so much for watching uh, this episode. Don't forget, if you guys like what you see, hit that like and subscribe button. If you guys don't like what you see, you can hit that dislike button too. But please let me know down below what you guys are liking, disliking, all that fun jazz. Uh, don't forget, I'll also be streaming Guild Wars 2 on Tuesdays from now on at about 1 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Uh, that's the plan. Hop in, uh, play some uh, Guild Wars 2 with you. Um, actually, uh, about that, actually, in a couple weeks, I'll put it in the Discord. i got to be more active in the Discord. That's the plan. Um, my Tuesday is actually going to switch with Monday. Um, so it'll be a day where I stream on Monday instead of Tuesday. Uh, but yeah, thank you guys for watching uh, for this episode here. Uh, thank you guys so much for everything. And uh, as always, until next time. Keep your stick on the ice.